When it comes to creating an idea and creating a, a concept about a movie, um, do you tend to sort of integrate some sort of an underlying missive towards, you know, the whole story's point and so on? Or is it all about, you know, creating the most immersive experience? Just, you know, I'm interesting, I'm interested to hear your perspective as, you know, a, a creator of content like that. I've done a lot of different screenplays. Like I haven't only written horror. You know, mm -hmm. I've, I've got a, a screenplay called Seasons in the Sun about a little girl who gets sick mm -hmm. and she ends up being the strongest person in the entire movie. And she mm -hmm. teaches people, you know, to enjoy every minute and, you know, that kind of approach. Yeah. And I've got a, a family oriented uh, rock and roll comedy oh. movie about, you know, a, a 40 plus year old guy who loses his job. And uh, this is back around 2010 or so when the economy crashed and, you know, uh, the whole family was about to, to lose their house. The wife could barely get a, a job as a waitress. You know, they're barely hanging on. And he decides to put the band back together, yeah. you know, his band from college. And, you know, as he's trying to do this, it doesn't exactly work out the way that he wanted because one person had passed away. Another person uh, was was having some, some addiction problems mm -hmm. and... Uh, they couldn't rely on him. So the son-in-law, you know, joins, joins the band and, you know, just all sorts of, of interesting dynamics to where you can, you can really boil it down to it's a movie about friends and family and getting a second chance to chase your dreams. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty much about me, <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> You know, you you take some liberties with some stuff and what have you. Uh, the movie Seven Cells, mm -hmm. you can kind of break it down to where I've always had this, you know, uh, uh, asylums and psychiatric hospitals really scare me. Like, you know, what what if, and maybe it's back from One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest or, you know, some other some other things to where what if you're wrongfully admitted mm. to a hospital and because of the tranquilizers and different things they're giving you, you don't get out mm -hmm. and you just become what they thought you originally were. Yes. You know, that scares me. Mm -hmm. So you can boil these things down to kind of a, a like acts of death, for example, mm -hmm was the original thought was, you know, what would I do if somebody like really uh, did something bad to my daughter? Yeah. That's, you know, she was maybe four when I wrote it mm -hmm. uh, <clears throat> or came up with the idea. So, you know, it, it just, it stemmed from there. And okay. I think most good ideas you can boil it down to something very simple, uh, whether it's the theme of it or the log line that you use or whatever, mm -hmm. you should be able to pare it down to something very, very quickly explainable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, this makes all the sense. Um, in, in the beginning of the conversation, you obviously mentioned that, you know, in the, in the start of the creative process, you kind of decide um, as you've mentioned, whether you want to write a movie that is to be shot or, you know, just to express your, you know, uh, grand ideas, I guess. And I'm interested to hear, have you, have you wrote a script for a movie that uh, at some point you would like to be done, you know, given, and given the circumstances that you can operate with all the budget that you need and, you know, all that? Yeah, Seven Cells is one of them. Uh, Amazing. And part of the, uh, yeah, like I said, I have seven. Mm -hmm. I have seven that I've written that uh, have not been shopped around. They haven't, uh, you know, 
uh, been been pitched or packaged or what have you. Mm-hmm. And you know, they're they're all larger budgets, you know, a couple million, a few million. Mm-hmm. Um so yeah, those were written kind of as a hybrid of I can't really do it for fifty thousand dollars, yeah, but I don't need a hundred million to do it either. Mm-hmm. So, you know, those were all done to be able to be made, but just not right this minute.